How you doing? This is the last post for the day. Let's pay all due respects to the creator. Sun rises. Assalamu alaikum. Good morning. signals that you see me just did. I want y'all to understand something. There's been hand symbols for thousands of years. Understand them. You do it all the time. The minute you shake your man's hand like this, those are hand signals. Signs. But when you see something that you don't understand, the first thing you're thinking is, oh, what is that? That looks scary. And then a lot of you go, well, that's Umala. I'm a, what's that? Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. They call it a, a, a Illuminati. First of all, if you understand the true manufacturers of the, the Illuminati, the Illuminati that you see now is a common copy of the tr this true of the Illuminati. Illuminati are the wise ones, the wise ones, the wise ones that was carrying the knowledge, and they had to protect the knowledge that they had. So they formed the group that knew Illuminati. These are the wise people, not the Illuminati that you see on the Hollywood. And all they did was took the Illuminati, the Masons, and all these things. They took these conceptions and they basically reversed it into their own concept. What knowledge do they possess? Some people say, oh, they worship the devil. The devil who? The devil wouldn't even exist if your mind wasn't thinking of such things. The devil wouldn't exist if you would sit there and watch these negative movies. And some of them are entertainment. I've watched them over years. You know, I have my favorites in that time. But when you indulge in such negativity, then your mind will begin to accept this and you open up channels in these different dimensions. Yes. And when you open up your mind to different dimensions, you're going to take yourself there. But don't blame nobody but yourself. Let's be honest. I had told y'all before. I'm into the spiritual thing. I believe in helping my people out. Literally. And the reason why I do that is because all concepts is great. And if you think it's not, you're fooling yourself. All. And I'm going to show you all what I mean by that. Check that out. All concepts. You have the Kemetic, Moorish, Muslims, Christians, Hebrew. Five that forms a fist of power. The reason why that's there is because we need to unite, unify. For some reason, it just don't happen. Maybe in the future, I don't know. But I study a little bit from each one of them. Watch their videos, literally. Watch their videos. And be, you know, and do a little research on them. 
And I think most people should do that. You should do that. I want to let you know, I'm into the spiritual thing. Understand that I am into the spiritual. I am into the spiritual. Understand the concept of simple fact is because you need to listen to our ancestors. Or oh, they speak. The question is, are you listening? Are you listening? Huh? Are you listening to our people? Are you listening to the to your deities? When all you be praying and talking about, Amen. You are praying to a real deity, a real man whose name was Amen. Did you know that? Did you know that? That's Amen right there. Huh? You want to see our set? There's our set right there. Her husband, her saw. There you go, right there. That's her saw. According to the story. I saw I had a brother. Pay attention to it. I saw I had a brother. His brother killed him. Chopped him up in 14 pieces, according to the story. I sat. Found every last piece except one. That piece was the, the penis, because the penis was thrown into, into the river. And of course, the fishes ate it. I saw it was the first money. Mummy five. According to the story. According to the story. A set had a son. His name was Haru. Hmm? You wanna see Haru? There he goes right there. That's Haru. Now, according to the story, the African system story, thousands of years before Christianity, before an Adam and Eve, before Cain and Abel, Set chopped his brother up into 14 pieces. Do your research. According to the story. Now, Asa, supposed to have, as he was mummified, risen. And when he was risen, he came back to Aset and got her pregnant. Sound familiar? Got her pregnant. But in Africa, Haru was born. And Haru rose up. Defend his father's honor and take revenge. A war broke out. Haru eventually beat his uncle. He lost an eye. That all seeing eye? Huh? That all seeing eye? That all seeing eye, right? Let me give you something. 
That all saying I you seem to think you know what you're talking about. But that all saying I is also dealing with the pineal gland. That's for another story. That's in the brain. See, it's two different stories. One dealing with science. The other one dealing with the eye that was taken out through a wall. So you got the this symbol here. It's dealing with the pineal gland that's in the brain. And when you show your picture of the pineal gland, you will see the representation that looks like that. But the, also the story also goes, the other story is how Rude lost his eye, according to the story. So, I just want y'all to understand something. That how you don't want to understand your symbols. Life. The Unk. The Unk has many, many different meanings. Many. And I'm going to get the book right now. Hold on for a minute. I'm back. Now, I showed you the symbols, and this is why I keep trying to tell y'all. I keep talking about cults and all these other things and because you don't understand why somebody is doing what they're doing and why they, they're spearing themselves away from how society is. It's not they, it's not they don't want to be with um, other people. It's just that they do their research and understand the conception of this, how society is. And I, like I told you, I'm going to show you African people who's worshiping white people. Like they're worshiping white people like they're gods now. Africa. But let's get into this real quickly. It's just simple. You see the eye? The sun. The unk. But you all think that all the unks are the same. You think all the unks are the same? No, they're not. Each unk is different. And I can prove it. The unk, the African origin of the electromagnesium. Get this book and you'll be able to understand it. Get it. Get it. It's more than just telling about the woman's womb and such thing and so forth. Emotep, the builder of the first pyramid. Emotep. He wasn't just a master builder. He was in science. African plasma and physics. Understand what I'm about to show you. Dealing with the unk. Understand. See, if you don't do your research and understand science and where, how to get light from, what you think? In ancient times, they had no light? Oh, well, they was they had um, 